Welcome to the chemistry question. Jordan here, and today I'm starting a new series, Know Your Poison. In this first episode, we will cover alcohol, and more specifically, the difference between methanol and ethanol. On paper, it doesn't look like there's much of a difference, that ethanol is just methanol with an additional carbon and a couple hydrogens thrown on. One would expect them to have similar properties, and they do, both causing intoxication. However, ethanol is the alcohol in drinks enjoyed by many, and while making them act like idiots is not overly toxic unless ingested in incredibly large amounts over a short period of time. Methanol, however, is a famous poison that is known to cause blindness and death even in small amounts. Why, then, is methanol so toxic compared to ethanol? Turns out that methanol is not toxic to humans until metabolized when the body breaks it down to formaldehyde and formic acid, which attack the central nervous system. The breakdown products of ethanol, however, are acetaldehyde and acetic acid, the latter more commonly known as vinegar. These are harmless and are eventually converted to acetyl-CoA to be used in cellular respiration. On alcohol used for industrial purposes, you often see the label denatured alcohol. This refers to ethanol with a small amount of methanol added. This comes from the Prohibition era when the United States government required methanol to be added to all industrial alcohols to make it toxic to human consumption and therefore keep people from drinking it. Turns out, just because the alcohol was potentially lethal did not prevent people from taking the risk, and the rates of methanol poisoning skyrocketed. Just remember, if you're going to drink denatured alcohol, know your poison. Thank you for watching the chemistry question. Leave questions and suggestions in the comments below, and be sure to subscribe. Until next time.